in the morning to do your routine before work and school. You brush your teeth and you shampoo your hair. You never make the connection between your products and endangered species or the cutting of trees. Um, that is because it does not take trees to make the products. It takes palm. Palm that is being poorly managed in the rainforest of Southeast Asia just to satisfy our endless needs. In 2015, Zhe Zhang, Zhang, PhD author and researcher at Princeton University said, Researchers used satellite data to find that deforestation in Malaysia and Southeast Asia amounts to a loss of 113,000 square miles of trees. To make this more clear, that is twice the size of New York. Trees are being cut down at an alarming rate in Southeast Asia, which accounts for habitat loss and the endangerment of several animals. At the at the end of this speech, you will take home knowledge about products that can be sourced to this environmental catastrophe. My research includes scientific data, environmentalist standpoints, and TED Talks. I am a lover of environmentalism, have attended Earth Fair 2016, and have finished several lengthy papers on environmentally related topics. I will describe the amount of trees lost, for one. For two, I will inform you how this deforestation affects animals. Third, I will identify what products are affected by the world's need for palm. In a pretty recent assessment of forest cover of Southeast Asia, details were gathered. Rainforest loss between Southeast Asia and Papua New Guinea was just under 3 million square kilometers. Just looking at the timeline between 1990 and 2010, it fell to 300,000 square kilometers. These numbers are overwhelming. Just within the region alone, this amounts to the size of Norway. Can you imagine going on a vacation trip to Norway, but instead of seeing beautiful landscapes, you just see tree stumps for miles and miles? According to the World Wildlife Foundation, in 2018, the main cause of degrading forests was illegal logging. We are losing to what is equal to soccer fields every minute. These forests have already been cut down by 17%. This is in 50 years. This can be already linked to cattle ranching, even areas that would be considered country or rural are torn down. The need for palm oil is increasing. Much of the world's mahogany, gold, and oil are being taken right in front of us. People from their own country are in fear of these losses. According to a Malaysian professor and resident of Nanging Wei Chang, he has a PhD of uh, geography and he's a professor at the university in Malaysia. He states, as Malaysia pushes ahead to meet its target of a fully industrialized country by the year 2020, further environmental degradation is extended to occur. Daniel Drolet, a visitor of Vietnam, said, I saw a mile long red scars on the sides of green tree covered mountains. The highest lands in Vietnam was being clear cut for a controversial dam, disposing many of the local Dao tribes people in the process. Now that I've talked about, uh, talk about the amount of trees lost, I would like to discuss the species that are at risk. According to the cartographers that work with the Grit Ardenal Norwegian Foundation, if the deforestation of these critical forests continue between 13% and 42% of the species will be lost in Asia by 2100. The loss of the species can cause other environmental impacts since these, this affects the sensitive balance of an ecosystem. According to the World Wildlife Fund, the south section of Southeast Asia is losing its jungles, Sumatra, and Ryan. This cute little guy. The real number of Sumatra and Rhino is considered unstable and has already been affected by hunters and poachers. Palm oil is the main link to the loss of this, these rhinos in Malaysia and Sumatra. Hiding within these small rainforests left in Indonesia lives a Sumatra tiger. The last number of these rare tigers were recorded in 2016, and it was close to 400. The only place in the world to have wild rain changes is Indonesia. The country is busy supplying 85% of the world's palm oil. With all of the massive habitat loss, we only see 80,000 left of these little guys. These numbers put the Borean uh, orangutan on the official endangered species list. Now that I have talked about endangered species, I would like to discuss common products that are connected to this catastrophe. Palm oil can commonly be found in the ingredients of many 
Simple House products such as Vaseline, dog food, ice cream, shampoos, and milk substitutes. Everyday products you use to clean your hands and clothes are also involved with the palm industry. You can find palm in soap and cleaning detergent. Palm oil is like a wool in sheep's clothing, but in toothpaste form. Trees are being cut down for commercial and industrial purpose. First, I described the number of trees lost. Second, I told you how it is affecting Southeast Asia's habitats and wildlife. Third, I explained where this connects to our products and the way it is being distributed. So the next time that you are washing your hair or brushing your teeth, you will have a better understanding of the ingredients. According to my college class survey, 10 out of 20 are aware of deforestation as a current world issue. Deforestation affects so much of the world. Knowing that these animals and forests are in declining numbers allows people to choose products with a different standpoint. Thank you very much.